What is poppin' everybody on YouTube? I am your boy Wes, and this is Kicks from Wes. Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time watching, be sure to hit that subscribe button, tap that little bell so you'll be notified when I post videos and go live on YouTube. And if you like the content that I'm putting out, by all means, smash that like button. It helps out the channel, and I definitely would appreciate it. Welcome back to another video. And today, we finally have in hand the NYCC 2020 Comic Con exclusive Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice! That's right. He has arrived, and he is here. So, we're going to get into all of that. Sit back, relax, go grab a snack, and let today's episode begin. Before we get into the Beetlejuice, I stopped at GameStop yesterday and was just in there looking around for Pokemon cards. And don't forget, that Pokemon video is coming up soon. I got some more surprises for that, so be on the lookout for that. Be sure to have your post notifications turned on because I'm also going to be announcing something within that video that you guys want to pay attention to. So be on the lookout for that video coming to you guys very soon. But like I was saying, I was in GameStop yesterday just looking around for pops and things, see what was on sale. And I came across a piece that I was looking for for a hot minute. That's right. I got this for $5.94. It was on clearance. So I don't want nobody to think I'm capping. Bang, bang. And then, what is that? Yeah. Right there. What I'm pointing to. $5.97 for the piece that I was looking for for a good minute, man. And I'm happy to add this now to the collection. Everyone that I ran across, the boxes was messed up. They was dented. They was uh, heavily damaged. Or it just wasn't in the greatest shape to my liking. So the piece that I'm talking about is the Batman and Catwoman. Y'all know me, huge Batman fan. And this was one that was definitely, definitely on my radar, definitely on my wish list. And I got it, man. So check out the back right here. I don't know what the original price on this was. I believe the original price was $29.99. Somebody down in the comment section let me know if I'm right, if I'm wrong, like you guys always do. But I always appreciate that help as well. But yeah, check this one out here, right here, man. Definitely dope. I know the glare from the box is coming off the camera and everything like that, but definitely dope, man. I'm not sure if I'm going to be taking it out of the box or keeping it in the box. I am still undecisive on that right there. And yeah, man, like I said before, definitely happy to uh, run into GameStop and find this. Not only to be on clearance, but to be in a shape that I was willing to pay for it. Next on the list, we picked up one of these retro toys, mini mystery joints right here. Y'all know me, I always like picking up the latest one. Um, I did come across some Venom ones, but they were not on sale, so I did not grab them. And I had a coupon for $5 off because I am a pro member at GameStop. I did not renew my membership for over four and a half years, man. And the only reason I did renew it because they had... 25% off and that was last week so they got me <laughs> because I was like no I don't want to renew it I don't want to renew it I don't want to renew it and then when I was looking for what I was looking for I had no choice to pay that $15 but hey it's for the whole year I ain't tripping and each month I get a $5 off coupon so that comes in handy whether it be towards pops or whatever I'm looking for in GameStop Oh, I can show you guys the back of the box and what you can get. So, I'm not looking for any particular one. Happy to get uh, any one out of the bunch. No, I would like the the blue character up top right there. So, second one to the right, if the camera would focus. There we go. So, that's a G.I. Joe character. I believe he's on the Cobra side of things. Uh, like I said before, correct me if I'm wrong about that. Could be, or I could be right. So, 
Let's see. Let's see what I got. And filling around. And I already think I know what I got from just from filling in the box, uh, in the bag, man. So I believe this is one of the potato head characters. Am I right? <laughs> yeah, I'm right. It just felt that way, so. It's all good. Like I said, I would have liked to get one of the uh, Cobra characters, Mrs. Potato Head, right? This is Mrs. Potato Head? Mm, no, Mr. Potato Head. He just got on glasses and I wonder why they got him. Mm, interesting. But yeah, I guess this is the kid. Whatever the case may be, but yeah, that is that. Now, let's get into, uh, man, I couldn't think for a second. Beetlejuice. Hopefully, this is the one, because also, let me uh, know in the comment section, was you guys able to pick up anything off the Funko Wing uh, Drop Part 2? For me... I came away with the blueberry soda can, and I think that this is with it as well. Not to note, this is a stack, so this is Beetlejuice himself. And this one here is going to be that soda can of blueberry. This was a 3,000 piece, so hopefully I got the chase, but if not... Still, all in all, happy to add Booberry to my collection. I also was able to purchase uh, Woody Woodpecker that released, what was that, yesterday, day before? Yeah, so, here we go. Nice packaging, as always, with Funko. You never see now. This is this is the part that, that be getting people all messed up. So, if you read the box right there. Says Booberry with the chase. No, no, baby. No, no. We're going to find out right now. We're going to see what it is. What it is, cuz. What it do, cuz. What it is. Oh, I'm sorry. It's not 3,000 piece. It's 4,500 piece. Limited edition. So here is the soda can. Check that out. Bang, bang. So let's open this bad boy up. See if I got the chase. Hopefully I did. I don't need the knife for this one. Should just use these hands. Let's see here. Let's see, baby. I don't buy these outside of Funko. Reason being is um I've seen videos, i heard stories about how people have uh, gotten these soda cans and they've been tempered with in the whole nine yards. So for me, if it ain't from Funko, I ain't buying it unless in the description it tells me that it has been sealed. So yeah, alrighty, top just flew over there. Uh, the little cap is inside there and it'll tell you if you got the chase or not, but I'm not going to look at that yet. Just leave that where it is. Okay, moment of truth. <coughs> excuse me, excuse me. Man, this thing is heavily packaged, but I appreciate that. And make sure your stuff don't come damaged. It's one thing you gotta appreciate about Funko. Alright, so I'm trying to see which way is which. Feels like the face. There we go. I can't see because I covered it with my hand. Let me know right now if I got the chase or not. Let me see. Is this a chase? Or is this a regular? Regular Duggar? No, it's the regular. Yep, did not get the chase, but it's all good. I got 
1,000. I mean, I got number one out of 3,750. Man, camera's acting up today. Sorry, you guys. There we go. So check out Boo Berry right there. He is clean, man. Clean on the scene. That's right. So, yes. Alrighty. I ripped that paper up. It's all good. Put them in there like that. Now, the moment you all been waiting for. Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice! Did I get the con sticker? We about to find out, man, right now. So, let's see. Let's see, baby. And if I didn't, it's okay. I'm just happy to be able to add him to the collection because I missed out. Um, GameStop in my local area. They only had a few in stock, and people was out there way, way early. Remember I talked about that being lion, beast mode, you know what I mean? Did I get it? Did I get it? I can't see. Is it a yes? Is it a no? It's upside down. Let me see. I think I did. Ooh, wee, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I did. So, yes, sir. So, check him out. Got the kind sticker on there. You know what I mean? Some people go crazy over stickers. For me, I am a sticker fanatic. I ain't gonna lie to you guys. I keep it 1,000 here on this channel. If you don't get nothing, you will get the honest and raw truth from out of my mouth, man. I don't hold nothing back when it comes to things how I feel and when I voice my opinion. And I always keep things 1,000. So, yes. Check out Beetlejuice. He does glow in the dark. And I will put pictures up on the screen of the glow variant and here's the rest of the collection on the back of the box will i be going after the rest of this set right here uh let me see let me see i doubt it i just wanted this one because it go in the dark y'all know me i'm a fan for things that go in the dark so yeah check him out turn to the side so you can see him holding the book right there in his hand and he looks dope, man. He already looks dead in the box. So, you know, that glow is going to be super hard. Pause. <laughs> so, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Here he is, ladies and gentlemen. Got him in the collection now. And I'm not taking him out of the box. He will be put in a pop protector and placed on the good old shelf back there with the rest of the collection. That has been added here. Thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate every single last one of y'all. And for those that are new here, go check out some of the other videos that's up on the channel. Definitely would appreciate that as well. And if you like anything, please hit that like button. It helps out the channel. And I most definitely would appreciate it. Until the next video, everybody stay fresh. Stay blessed. I am your boy Wes. And this is Kicks from Wes. Catch you guys on the next one. I'm out, baby. Peace.